well it's very specific to that purpose there <laughs> shot Here, can i pass you guys we're on yep Big one. It's early, really early for us. We are driving from Erie, Pennsylvania down to Central PA more so. Not Central Central PA, but like kind of more Central, but we're targeting muskies today. We just had a big day of catching smallmouth bass that were entering Presque Isle Bay uh, for, for the spawn. We had some GoPro issues. Hopefully those are all sorted out, but we caught like 45 fish with an average of like three and a half pounds, all big monsters. I managed to do a tiny bit of footage filming on my phone, which I will put in now. And uh, got a lot of fish, it was a great time, but yeah, unfortunately not on camera. Lots of them. Try to buy worms in case we need to get bait and in case we need to get musky. Almost down. I'm changing up. Little guy be like, hello, my friend. Let's see what this looks like. <laughs> Let's take a cart. <laughs> no way. Not on the first cast. That's absolutely tragic. Here, hold on. There goes 12 bucks. First cast, love it. Live bait time. Bait, 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 bait. This will be the most exciting thing on the video if we don't catch any musky. Not really, only little things. I'm gonna try to get a bluegill. Yes. It's a pumpkin seed. It's a cool sunfish, come look at him. But he's also bait. Juicy bait, Scott, juicy baits only. And he has, to, what he's doing, he's fighting, he's fighting to keep it down. So he's just down there swimming like this. Hopefully something big comes by and is like, yep. <laughs> that's awesome that's a that fish is called a green sunfish here if you guys don't want to hold him out of the water too long you can bring him over here and I'll unhook him for you I'm pretty good at it here yeah. I don't really want him to die so I need it to be quick yeah. I can't believe he actually got a fish oh, yeah. I know see I told you right in that area we'd catch one see that's a green sunfish oh that's really awesome send him back uh -oh. There you go. See, swam away. Oh, good. Thank you. 
Here. Here, you guys can have these worms if you want them. Oh, yes. And there should I'll just, be a like, few. Take one and I'll just put oh yeah, no, just keep using them until you guys finish up, and then you can give them back. So these are your worms. Yeah, no, it's all right. We have we have another container of them too. Oh, okay. I'll just take found a rusty hook, a line, and tied it to a stick. Found a worm and caught one. I gave him a few more worms though. That's crazy. Like they found like someone's leftover line and it had a hook on it and it was like super rusty. Perch. Oh, actually, this is a log perch. We're not gonna use it as bait. Uncommon fish. What time is it? Wow, it's a big green sunfish. I think there's one more in there. What we might do is we might pack up our stuff and go to the other side. We've hit this side a whole heck of a lot. Maybe try one or two casts over at the other spot. Scott, got one! Scott! I need your help. Come over here. And I turned off the GoPro by accident in the heat of the moment. Here, back up a little. Musky. <laughs> hey, Scott. What is it like? Okay, friend. He's got to catch his breath. Yeah. There he goes. Whew. I was like, so I accidentally thought the camera was off when I got the hook set so I had turned it off part way through the fight and I thought I turned it back on but I didn't press the button it's such a shame because it was a, a crazy fight where I had to get off the, the, the top of the bylaw in there and then jump down here to land it we landed it made sure it got released nice and safe we took a quick photo and then sent it back but unfortunately with the net we have is this little thing so we pretty much just got the back half of it on and then scooted them up onto the into this area and then grabbed them and picked them up so it worked out but uh that's a pennsylvania muskie a small one though very small one yeah well what's nice is we had this little bank to get them on without like we didn't bash them on anything we just kind of shoveled them up here held them took a quick picture and released them well like <laughs> did about as good as we could have there that revitalized me i want to get another bait and try it again but like you can see how long we've been doing that. I did that for like 30 minutes. We were about to give up. Like I tell, I'm telling you, fish of a thousand casts. That's how it happens. I might try a perch if you keep fishing for bait. What is it? What? What? Yeah, bring that, bring that. 100%. That has to be arguably the best bait you could have caught. Good job. <laughs> yeah. At first I was like- I didn't know that they were in here, but this is, this is prime. How big is gonna be that? <laughs> <laughs> no, a little musky like that could totally munch this guy. Hi. Scott! Here, can I pass you guys? Oh, yeah. We're on! Yep. This is some maneuvering stuff. Yeah. No, it's a musky, even. I am gonna jump once I scoot this way. Whoop. Yep. Little one. Cute. He can fit in the net. 
Careful, careful. Actually, no, stop. We're good, we're good. Scott, 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 stop. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Beautiful. It's number two. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, I was like trying not to drop him on the ground, so I just kind of scooted him into the water and he ended up getting off, but that's that's all we needed. The that was a little thing. one. Yeah, so just, let's get it. Let's try that again. Right. They're eating. I told you I that. Just, I just caught a little chub. Like catch, right catch another chub. When you showed me that, yeah. when you said chub and it was that big, I knew that was going to get eaten. That's literally like the best bait you could possibly get. I watched that muskie come up and eat it, Scott. That was so cool. I was like, why is it chub so high? And it was like up against the wall going, ah, ah, ah. And the muskie was like, no. They're in a mood right now. So I need to catch a bait quick. Yes. What's that? Oh, it's a trout. It's your hook. It has to be seven inches, I'm fairly certain. That's seven inches, right? So you can, in fact, use a trout as bait if it's seven inches, which is legal size in Pennsylvania. Scott, big one. He's on the wall. This is a big one, Scott. Yep. Where's he at? Oh, he's right there. There's a big one, Scott. Uh, the net might not be the move. Yeah, I really want to Just head, head him up here. All right. You ready? Hold that. Let go. It's hard to handle them. Yeah. Right here. There she goes. They just got in a mood all of a sudden. We were here for four hours. Not a single hit. Using artificials the entire time, and we're like, "Okay, let's try to catch a few live baits." And uh, then we fished for like two hours with live baits and we were like, oh, we're done. I'm going to take one more cast here. Hooked up, next cast, hooked up, next cast, hooked up. So, three. 